I can't even balance on one foot, like, standing up. Let me try. <laughs> Reapers, what is good? It's your boy Laser. He's vibes back with another reaction video. He's in the reaction content. Sorry, Team Julia, I think you guys Top 10 senses you didn't know you have. Guys, we have uh, eight senses, right? See, touch. <laughs> that was eight, right? I don't even know. But if you guys enjoy that reaction content, these more reaction views, like the features, Mr. the button. You subscribe to the notification bell icon. I also stream every night on Twitch. Go check out the streams. Like amazing. Let's dive straight in this video. Coming up at number 10 we now, go. we have time. You know that this moment right now is not the same moment as when the video started. Something has changed. You instinctively feel it. This is your sense of time. Just like your sense of taste or hearing, your sense of time can also be damaged. Some drugs can temporarily alter a person's perception of time. Look at that, bro. Is that, uh, it looks like a friendly, uh, it's, it's just paper. I'm sure that won't alter their fucking uh, mind and make them go, go on a whole ass trip. I'm sure this little smiley face with the white uh, paper on on it isn't going to do anything uh, to this person. I'm sure they, they'll they still be very uh, normal and functioning. I could take the keys any day. <laughs> Making minutes feel like months or even years. Disorders such as Parkinson's disease or schizophrenia can also affect a person's time perception. All right, next up at number nine now, we have temperature. What's the temperature where you are right now? Are you cold and watching this in bed under a duvet? Are you a little bit too warm and can't quite concentrate on the video? By the way, I know how this video is like talking about like senses you didn't know you had, but like if we're gonna be for like the main senses like that actually like really like are relevant is uh, C. Touch. Wait. So there's 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 like four basic ones that everyone knows, right? Or is it five? It's see, touch, smell, hear. What was the fifth one? I forgot. Smell. I don't remember. Maybe you feel just right. Whatever temperature you are, you are constantly sensing the environment around you, whether you're aware of it or not. The fancy name for this is thermoception, knowing how hot or cold an object or the environment is. And that's pretty cool. Or warm. Whatever. Coming in at number eight now, we have thirst. I bet you just checked to see if you're thirsty, didn't you? Thirst is perhaps the most thirsty important sense we have. It tells us that our body needs fluids. If you didn't drink for the next three days starting from now, you would probably die. Cells in your body need water for basic chemical reactions that keep you alive. Your brain tells you that you're thirsty thanks to a clever feedback loop called the renin angiotensin system. The fact that some motherfuckers gotta like drink out like their own pisses and shit, bro, like those poor ass areas, bro. Oh my god. Hurts my soul, man. The first is an important sense, but I know I don't need to tell you guys that. You wouldn't be here if you didn't drink when you're thirsty. I gotta fill my water just watching, right, bro. Seven, now we have I'm direction. Thirsty. If you stand up and spin around slowly with your eyes closed, you'll still probably know exactly which way you are facing. That's quite easy thanks to our internal sense of direction. Wherever you go, your brain creates a spatial map of the area you're in. Neurons fire off in the hippocampus section of your brain that form a sort of grid. Your brain then uses this grid to instinct know how to navigate your way back to somewhere. Some people are better at this than others, but we all have it. All right, coming in at number six now, we have balance. This has a fancy name, equilibrioception. It's very simple though, it's what keeps you from falling over when moving or even standing still. It's an incredible sense because you- I can't even, no. Motherfuckers be balancing on like tie ropes and shit, bro. Dude, I can't even balance on like my own foot. Like, and she's doing it like near the, oh my God, this is beautiful, bro. Holy shit, this is beautiful. I can't even balance on one foot, like, standing up. Let me try. Fuck me. Ah, shit. What the fuck? You really aren't aware of it. When you stand up, your body is actually doing millions of calculations and adjustments to 
keep you upright. Your eyes and inner ears communicate with the muscles and joints to keep you balanced. It's a sense we develop from a very young age and use it to take our first steps in the world. However, it can be interrupted. If you've ever felt dizzy, you'll know what it feels like to lose your sense of balance and perhaps the embarrassment of falling over right after that. Next up at number five, we have pain. Now at first you might think, no Danny, no, pain is a part of your sense of touch, but that isn't necessarily true. There is also neuropathic pain. This is a type of chronic pain such as a spinal injury. A person's spine may not be touching anything that could hurt it, but it still hurts. I have spine fluid. <laughs> the fact that we have fluid in our spines, bro. <laughs> Does, we, does our cum supply go all the way to the spine? I know that lies beneath the pants. Dun, 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 dun. Unzip it. <laughs> I have two jiggly uh, testicles. Who wants to lick them? Hurts. This can be caused by damage in the brain or in the neuron pathways between the brain and the cells. In many ways, this can be a lot worse than acute physical pain because there may be no simple cure for a pain that isn't caused by normal means. Moving on to number four now, we have hunger. In many ways, this is quite similar to thirst. Hunger is your body's way of telling you that you need food to fuel your body. However, unlike thirst, your body can go a lot longer without food. You may feel hungry a few hours after- Bro, what the fuck? What are you doing? after you eat, but a healthy person can go weeks without food, ignoring the sensation entirely. Hunger, like thirst, is a hard sensation to describe. You just kind of feel it. It's somewhere there, isn't it? But you can't quite put your finger on what it is. It's just an unpleasant feeling. Either way, food ends hunger. However, most people don't know that satisfying hunger occurs 5 to 20 minutes after you finish eating. So, if you finish your meal and you're still really hungry, maybe wait five minutes before you have seconds. Next up at number three now, we have proprioception. This is the sense of knowing where your body is. This might sound weird, but close your eyes. Can you feel where your left leg is? Yes? Well, that- Yeah, my left leg is right here, right? Fine. All right, guys, am I holding a- Is this an eye drop? Hold on, let me put it in my eye. Ah! That is proprioception. It's a sense of the relative position of your body parts. It also means you can sense when they are moving. We know this because even if you can't see your limbs, even if nothing is touching them at all, even if they are not in the slightest bit hot or cold, even if there is not a single clue as to what position they are in, you still know where they are. If you think about it, that's a pretty important sense. You always want to know where your arms and legs are. Next up at number two now, we have magnetoreception. This one might sound a little crazy. Crazy, but stay with me. It's the sense of magnetic fields. It's something we know many animals have. One famous example is birds. They use their sense of Earth's magnetic field to- I love birds. Look at those cute little uh, geese. Duck, duck, geese navigate the entire planet. For many years, the common wisdom has been that humans don't have this, but there is a possibility that we all do, just in a very weakened and hidden state. You see, there's a pr protein in our eyes called cryptochrome that other animals use to detect magnetic fields, but for some reason, we haven't mastered using it yet. Scientist Joe Kirschfink did an experiment that appeared to show people's brains responding to magnetic fields around their head that they weren't consciously aware. What are those, yeah, like, what are these, do these, like, I used to think these were like deadly things they put on their heads. <laughs> aware of. Perhaps this sense is an ancient sense that humans no longer need, but can be unlocked for us to use once more. And finally, number one, we have hot and cold water. Okay, this one is even more crazy, but check this out. Hot I'm going to play you two sounds now. Both of them are of running water. One of them is hot water, and one of them is cold water. Listen to them both, and then see which you think is which. Okay, here is the first one. And now here is the second one. No, that one's no. That one, the second one's definitely cold. That just sounds like that just sounds like the type of water I, you know, I put the ice cubes like late at night, bro. I'd be going inside my house. Um, I don't go inside my house late at night often because like, you know, I don't I don't stream in my house. Like my current setup is in my house. I have a barn. I stream in a barn, so I gotta like walk to my house. No, I'm not fucking. I'm not saying that like I'm rich, but I, I'm not. I'm literally not. But we, we got our, I let's see, like, technically, like, I live with my parents still, but, like, I live in my own, like, place, like, that's separate from my parents, you get what I'm saying? But, um, yeah, you know what I'm saying? 
Okay, do you have an answer? Just go with your gut. But the second one's definitely cold because um, the ice, I, that just sounds. The first one was cold water. The second Wait, one. Wait, what? was hot water. Let me know Bullshit. in the comments if you got that right. If you did, you're a part of the 96% of people who also have this strange sense. You see, hot water has- That's such a random ass ESPN type sense, bro. ESPN type stat, you know what I'm saying? Faster than- like, that's like, that's a, this was a, like, putting this sense in the video is equivalent to like an ESPN stat, you know what I'm saying? Like two different things, but like, same compare, like, you still compare them in a way, you know what I'm saying? Moving molecules, which resonate at a different frequency to the slow moving molecules in cold water. Nobody ever taught you that, but you have a clever brain that figures it out anyway. Well, I sense we have reached it? the end of the video. Well, guys, that's it for this video. Hope you enjoyed it. Which one of those senses was the most interesting to you? Here's the reaction content. Here's the reaction of you using features and to do. I'll see you next one. Peace.